Hello, welcome to New Life Scientific. My name is Steve. Today we're going to be talking about the Eppendorf EP Motion 5070. This particular model is the TMX model, the thermal mixer model. Um, very nice uh, line of liquid handlers. Um, the software uh, for it is stellar. We'll be showing you the EP Blue um, on a computer. Uh, which is a little different than the control panel, uh, but very nice um, uh, operating uh, software for the unit. Um, the machines themselves are configurable a lot of different ways. Um, as I was saying, with the thermal mixer, this one has a, has a second thermal plate. A lot of different heads available, a lot of different accessories, and we'll be talking about that shortly. One of the uh, things that is somewhat unique about this liquid handler is it has an optical sensor so that it does check the height of your plates, um, that it checks the, the type of equipment uh, that you've got loaded and that it matches the program. Um, so it'll use a, a code on the plate or on the device that tells it what it is um, and that if it's in the right, that if it's that it's correct. Uh, anyway, we'll talk about that in the software, which, as I said, mentioned is EP Blue. Um, we're running it right now in a user slash administrator mode. If you're running it in a user mode, some of the applications that you're seeing here won't show up, uh, such as the application editor, but the application runner will. In this, the administrator mode, you can do both. This is the uh, application editor. It does have a link to directly to the running mode so you can experiment with your run. Very easy to use. Um, graphically, as most of them are now graphically inclined, this one uh, does show if you're moving plates with this unit is equipped with a plate mover, it will represent that. One of the nice things about this software is that you don't have to remember what's in a particular well. The software, you're always calling the plate number one, plate number one, regardless of what area it's moved to. So it does make it a lot easier to um, control. Uh, easily workable system. Um, easily configurable, lots of different uh, accessories uh, available. When we're ready to run, you can tell it to pull up the run module. It does have a 3D simulator mode, which will allow you to run um, and preview the program, make sure there's no uh, surprises in it. Um, we're just going to go ahead and run it. I've run this one. Very simple program, just strictly for moving plates. Um, at this point, the system is, is going to run. First thing it's going to do is going to check uh, the inventory uh, the, uh, of what's in the program, what's mentioned in the program, to see if it's there, if it's the correct height, and if it's the correct model. It then checks the heights of the plate, so it knows what height the plate that that's that's there. Uh, so you really can't mess up with your uh, with your field configuration. Um, very nice unit in this respect. A lot of different, uh, as I was talking about, a lot of different accessories available. We're going to let this um, uh, run for a minute here. As soon as it picks up the the plate moving apparatus. Very quiet unit. It does have a, uh, a guard shield. Heavy payload on that arm, uh, so it can miss, mix some very heavy plates. Uh, which it can do. Most of the, um, the apparatus we're going to be showing, it can move. Um, here are 
as, we, as it's showing there, it has a thermal plate into it. These, there's another plate rack for doing both two mil, a microliter, one and a half microliter, and half a microliter uh, plate by using an insert to convert the plate. These are thermal mix and mixable uh, compa uh, compatible, so you can heat them. Reservoir racks available with a lot of different size reservoirs. Uh, they include caps so that you can, for easier storage or leaving them in the unit night, um, converters so you can convert uh, the reservoir rack into units that'll hold the microtubes, whether they're the two milliliter or using the inserts uh, to use the half a microliter. Um, of course, different reservoirs that uh, for the plate ones, you can get magnetic separators, uh, bead separations. Of course, there's a whole range of different tips and uh, multi-channel and single channel heads. Um, and of course, PCR um, plates. Um, again, they're heatable inside the unit. These plates can be used, can be moved. The Magnaflux uh, cannot. It is, it is a heavy plate. Anyway, um, this particular model, uh, as I said, uh, is, is available. Uh, we're going to be supplying with a general, uh, a generous supply of consumables. That's it today for the EP Motion 5075. Thank you very much. Have a great day.